Hi, I'm here today to bring you the latest fashion tech news that you need to know. My name is Anina and I'm the CEO of 360 Fashion Network. Before we start, if you want to receive this news roundup regularly, then hit that like button and smash that follow as we will be bringing you this news every week to keep you in the know of the top stories we think are important. Alright, first up, designed by Maria Ribina, Volume is a smart high neck collar that helps reinforce personal space, encourage self-care, and keep users warm during cold weather. The partial facial closure provides the feeling of personal space in a public setting. Personal space helps alleviate stress. Once synchronized with a mobile app, the collar will begin measuring users' daily voice tones to track their mood and mental health. Made of high-quality material, the collar creates a sound barrier absorbing most of the user's voice. The integrated electronics make it easy to connect to your phone. Personal conversations can now be held comfortably in public spaces without fear of being heard. News source, Design Boom, Live Persons AI bots create connections that are anything but artificial. The long-standing conversational AI company develops personalized smart commerce solutions that free up human service staff and deliver real business outcomes by proactively taking consumer intent into account. The company's intelligent bot solution tool integrates across major messaging platforms, including Instagram, Facebook Messenger, WhatsApp, and others, as well as a client brand's own website backend. It optimizes the conversational experience and flow between a customer and brand based on predefined bot powered templates, making it easy for a real life customer service associate to jump into the chat when needed. News source PSFK AI powered smart glasses for the blind can read and recognize faces. Developed on the Enterprise Edition of Google Glass, the smart glasses harness the power of artificial intelligence to extract different kinds of information from images, then speak it back to users in over 60 different languages. With its 8 MP camera, the glasses can scan digital and handwritten text from any surface, such as books, letters, or labels, and turn it into speech. The device can also give detailed descriptions of outdoor scenes and make private and secure video calls to trusted users. Additional features include color detection, light detection, object recognition and facial recognition, meaning users can pick out red socks from their white laundry, know when lamp is still on, find personal belongings, and identify colleagues in an instant. News source, Design Boom, Google announced new Pixel smartphones, earbuds, and its first smartwatch during Wednesday's I.O. conference. The Pixel Watch, which arrives later this year, integrates Fitbit technology to track health stats. It runs Google's Wear OS software, which allows users to download music, check messages, and more. The Pixel Buds Pro, earbuds have active noise cancellation and can connect to two devices at the same time. Google is also developing a Pixel tablet to launch next year. It offered a peek of its upcoming Pixel 7 and 7 Pro phones. Google concluded its I.O. presentation with a preview of its forthcoming R glasses. The product will have the ability to live translate conversations like subtitles for the real world. The video says that Google relied on its proven Google Translate software to break down language barriers in real time. News source, The Verge. The UK's Royal Mail aims to deploy up to 200 drones to deliver mail to remote areas within the next three years. The postal giant would purchase the UAVs from Windracers, a logistics drone company based in London. Last year, the Royal Mail began testing the twin-engine drones, which have an autopilot system and can carry a payload of up to 100 kilograms, 220 pounds. Now, the company says it wants to deliver mail on 50 new routes over three years. The first communities to benefit would be the Isles of Scilly, Orkney Islands, Shetland Islands, and the Hebrides. You'll be getting your fashion finally airdrop to you. News source, BBC, and that's it for today. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items of the week, check out our new podcast 360 Fashion or go to 360 Fashion net podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode.